I'll tell you something cool that happened over the break. A song I wrote years ago, uh, I wrote it in 2010, and then recorded it and released it on an album that came out in 2012 with the band Uncle Lucius. And uh, it's a true story about growing up in Freeport, Texas. It's a story about my dad that was, uh, he was hurt in a chemical accident in Galveston, Texas. He shouldn't have lived, but he did. And uh, I wrote the song when he was in his 50s. He's in his 60s now, so I had to change the lyric every time I sing it now, so you'll hear that in the last verse. <laughs> but uh, it was kind of, it became the biggest song Uncle Lucius ever had. And uh, over the, um, well, Uncle Lucius ended in 2018. And I think in 2019, the song was featured on Yellowstone. And I didn't even know what Yellowstone it was. And what happened was people were texting me and sending me messages and saying, man, congratulations, uh, you're on Yellowstone. I'm like, I haven't even been there. <laughs> Who's saying I was on it? <laughs> Sorry. Um, but then I saw it, and then I saw how many people were watching that show, and I, I said, uh, <clears throat> hey, Attorney, can you inquire into this? <laughs> and so my attorney did. And come to find out, that song was the only, on the only album that Uncle Lucius did with a record label uh, out of Nashville. And we signed a bad deal. But it's okay, because uh, it's a 50-50. They still own half of the publishing. So... What happened was Yellowstone contacted them and they said yes because they le legally can and they don't have to tell me and then it was on. And so I found out later and then inquired with the attorney and the attorney said, yeah, uh, you're owed some money. And then, uh, by the way, the YouTube has reached 70 million views for this video. And uh, the attorney said, Yellow probably owed some money for that too. Let me inquire. And then back and forth for about a year. Uh, yeah, oh, this is right, this is right. This wasn't accounted for correctly. This company's been bought out by another big company. I think a toy company, Hasbro or something owns it now, the record label, <laughs> it's crazy. But long story short, we are getting paid, we're supposed to get, be getting paid now. And it's very good, I'm very thankful. These are silver linings. And because of all of this, and then I think it's up to 90 million on the YouTube now, uh, we inquired, like, how many plays is that? You count a digital, how many streams and sales is so many sales? And so, uh, inquire about how many have been sold now. And so we did that, and then come to find out, uh, guess what? This record is gold. This song has gone gold. <laughs> this song, oh. <laughs> I drink the bottom half of this first one like a grown man. Yeah. Cheers to you. Salud. Oh, the peer pressure. In March of 2021, this song was certified gold, and then I was able to place the order with the place in Los Angeles, the only place that makes the real gold records. And uh, two weeks ago, they arrived at my house. <clears throat> and last weekend, I was able to de hand deliver each one to each member of the band, and we had a good little party. I also, because we all decided this, because this is a true story, we decided to get my parents one too, and I was able to deliver this to them. And you should have seen their faces, man. I didn't record it because I didn't. It's too real. It's too. It's it's the moment. It's right here. But they there is like disbelief and uh, I don't know. It's amazing. It was it was very good. So there are six. No, nobody told them. Oh, that's right. I've been telling that story that I'm about to deliver deliver them. Um, so the gold records are delivered, hanging on walls, and uh, we're going to play this one for you now. This is called Keep the Wolves Away. Two. 
Took my first breath where the muddy grasses spills into the Gulf of Mexico, where the skyline's colored by chemical plants and put bread on the table of the working man. Where the working man does his best to provide safety and shelter for kids and a wife. Giving a little of a soul every day, making old time to keep the wolves away. Mark Williams on the cello. I'm Kevin Galloway. Thank you very, very much for coming out. <laughs> 